Hi, welcome to Cell Phone Tech. Um, today's review day. Um, today is September 4th. Um, we're, today we're going to be doing a review of the LG Voyager. The next phone we will be doing will be the um, Casio GZ1 Rock. Then the Motorola Riser and some other phones, as you can see. Um, so this phone is a nice um, multimedia phone with a full touch screen and keyboard. Sorry, it's a little hard to open. Um, this phone's kind of old, but might as well do reviews. Um, on the front of the device, you have your earpiece. Um, the call quality on this phone is excellent. I used it for a while. Um, you have a two and a half inch touchscreen and three navigational controls: a send, a clear, and then button. Um, on the left side of the device, you have a designated camera key, a lock function, and the volume rocker. And on the right side of the device, you have the 1.5 millimeter headset jack and the micro SD slot. On the top of the device, you have nothing, and on the bottom, you have the charging port and the antenna for TV, which actually on mine is broken. When you open the device, you have the full um, same inch screen, I think it's 2.5, you have 2.5 inch screen on the inside, same resolution as the one on the outside, so same wallpapers. Um, dual speakers and your full cord keyper, keypad with two soft keys. This phone's fully responsive, it's very nice. What I like about it is... It's not big, and it's loud. It's almost as loud as the Motorola Droid. The phone um, has a haptic feedback when you touch the screen, so um, it's pretty nice haptic feedback. I really don't care. Um, it has LG's basic service menu. Um, LG's always good with the service menus and how they operate, um, they're all really nice. I haven't found one flaw with this phone, except for, um, Media that. You can't turn it off, or at least on mine. And there's some, are, there are some flaws, like the phone I have, it's probably just mine. On the bottom row of keys on the bottom row are all out. Um, it's been like that since the day I got it. Um, okay, that will be the review for the LG Voyager VX1000S. Um, for Verizon Wireless. Now this is the titanium version. Um, leave a comment, subscribe, tell me how I did. And if you're watching, just stay tuned for more reviews because today is review day. Goodbye.